In this video, we compare three modalities of correcting misrecognized words during a speech recognition task. These three modalities are using keyboard and mouse, using voice only, and using gaze. We tracked user's gaze using a commercially available Toby X1 eye tracker. The device tracks a subject's pupil movements and after a calibration procedure, it is able to estimate the point of regard of a computer user on a screen. The experiment consisted on a subject sitting in front of a computer which displayed a graphical user interface featuring a target sentence for the subject to utter. The graphical user interface also displayed on the top of the screen the correction modality to be used in case some of the words uttered by the subject are misrecognized by the speech recognition engine. The subject has 60 seconds in each trial to generate the target sentence using both his speech and the corresponding correcting modality. When the subject has successfully generated the target sentence or when 60 seconds have passed since the trial began, the subject can move to the next trial. An illustrative example of several trials using the keyboard and mouse modality for correction is shown next. I read a very interesting book. Keep a persistent eye on the ground. Peter was born in North Carolina. She thinks your paper is fantastic. Next, we show an example of how to use the voice modality to correct misrecognized words. Check out the best entries. Correct. She thinks your paper is fantastic. Correct your. Correct your. One. This song is constantly on my list. Correct sun. Song. One. Correct the, this, 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 three. Reports have simplified the conflict. Correct before. Correct before reports
one correct its half two two correct a remove I am now speaking to my computer correct no two correct speaking close correction close correction correct they correct they correct they correct are remove correct they correct they I am I am three and finally we show an example of how to use gaze to correct misrecognized words for visualization purposes we display a subject's gaze as a red disk superimposed over the graphical user interface this red disk was not visible to subjects during the experimental trials. We show it here just to better illustrate the gaze-based correction of misrecognized words. That occurred many years ago. Occurred The expense report has been approved. She thinks your paper is fantastic. Let me know if you are interested. If you he will resign from office. This concludes our demonstration video comparing different modalities of correcting misrecognized words in a speech recognition task. We hope you have found the combination of gaze and speech in a multimodal interaction paradigm a useful extension to achieve truly hands-free and smooth human-computer interaction. Thank you for your attention.